Today, I'm wearing a cowboy hat for some reason, and I'm going to be telling you about my favorite poem by my favorite poet, which includes showing you guys how a couple of stanzas written by an emo guy from the 1800s still affects us nowadays. I'm Marco, and you're watching Poetry Now. Poetry Now. Within a Dream is a short poem written by Edgar Allan Poe that was published in 1849 as a revised version of one of his earlier works. It is considered one of his finest pieces because it influenced a lot of modern movies and music, some of which you might know of, such as the Academy Award winning film Inception, where the theme of the movie involves the subconscious, and a song from the British progressive rock band The Alan Parsons Project where not only was Poe's work a major influence, but quotes from the actual poem were used as well. Now here's Conrad to tell you a bit about Edgar Allan Poe's life. Edgar Allan Poe was born on January 19, 1809 in Boston, Massachusetts. His parents were both professional actors, but they both died before he was three. He was raised in Richmond, Virginia by his foster parents. He started to write poems from a young age, sometimes on things he wasn't supposed to write on. He later went to the University of Virginia, but had to leave after a year because his father refused to pay. He then joined the army in Boston. He joined the U.S. Military Academy and started to publish some of his poems. He left the academy and then started to write poems full time. He then went to Baltimore, Maryland to live with his aunt and her daughter Virginia, whom he later married. And then they moved to Richmond, Virginia. She died from tuberculosis in 1847, and then Edgar Allan Poe died soon after. Reading of the poem. Take this kiss upon the brow, and in parting from you now. Thus much let me avow, you are not wrong, who deem that my days have been a dream. Yet if hope has flown away, in a night or in a day, in a vision or in none, is it therefore the less gone? All that we see or seem is but a dream within a dream. I stand amid the roar of a surf-tormented shore, and I hold within my hand grains of the golden sand. How few! Yet how they creep through my fingers to the deep. While I weep, while I weep, O oh God, can I not grasp them with a tighter clasp? O oh God, can I not save one from the pitiless wave? Is all that we see or seem but a dream within a dream? By Edgar Allan Poe. Symbol a symbol that we felt captured the essence of the poem is golden sand, because it appears to represent an hourglass as time is very important because you only have so much time in life. Cast. Before we read the poem, we thought it was going to be about a dream inside a dream. After reading the poem, we paraphrased it into a small summary. The poet kisses the person he is talking to while parting, he tells him or her that life has been a dream, and says that everything in life is a dream within a dream. We found five connotations. Rhyme, A, A, B, B, C, C. Alliteration, while I weep, while I weep. Personification, yet if hope has flown away. Metaphor and I hold within my hand grains of the golden sand. Repetition. While I weep, while I weep. The attitude was despair. There was one shift in the second stanza. After having a look at the title again, we saw that the poem was actually about the poet losing someone special in his life and his memories. The theme of the poem is that life is a dream and no matter how hard you're trying, some things are meant to be. 
That's all from us. See you next time on Poetry Now.